Welcome to Job Skills Share. Today I am going to be sharing some information about the labs that we do in this uh, course. So one of the students and um, some of the students in email also asked me, we have Active Directory um, a short course, but do we really have to install the server uh, to do all those steps? And the answer is no, you don't have to install any servers, any computers. Microsoft have um, provided a great technologies it's free so you guys can basically run it um, uh, from the web and uh, test all of this stuff so what you need to do is basically first you need to log in if you're new to this site you need to register and then do all this but this is for the people who are, who's already registered so I'm gonna quickly go through it so first you need to go to the portal which you're gonna sign in with your username and password once you sign in you basically have to go down all the way and Active Directory User Management Short Course, which is here. So you click on that course, and once you are done with the basic stuff, you go to the Learning Path, and then you go through all this stuff. Learning Path. Click on this one again, and on the left side you have like Active Directory uh, User Accounts. You click on this stuff. You read through it. Um, these are all videos. So yeah, some of you asked me, can we do this these steps without um? A install uh, we do we have to install it on our computers install installation of servers and anything you really don't need to do that so you get, can go through all of this and come all the way on the bottom and you can see right here 80 live labs from Microsoft and I put the link in here now so if you guys can go you don't have to click on it directly and here is I say copy this link to open an Internet Explorer because it will not work in Chrome or um, Firefox because it needs dot 3.5 dot net framework and they don't provide that so you're gonna get an error so what you need to do is copy this link and open your IE so once you go to your computer open Internet Explorer so right now I'm opening that right now and once this is Internet Explorer right now so what I'm gonna do is basically I'm going to copy that link into this browser and I'm just gonna wait for this to finish up with the MSN thing alright so that's done now I'm gonna right click and paste that link over here I'm just gonna wait a second so there you go and then I'm gonna enter and it will take me to that lab directly so right now you see this right here it says launch the lab actually the real lab is about the Windows Server 2012 R2 so you guys can also learn that in this lab by following the real lab that is provided by Microsoft you can go through it and test it out but uh, for this course you guys can also use it for Active Directory so when you click on the launch the lab and it will start inst installation just leave that installation if you get a prompt for installing something anything like that just run it so that it can install it piece uh, it needs to do that for it to work so then what you're gonna do is just wait for a second um, it is going to basically open the application and which where you will be able to access the server and any other um, technologies that are provided by this lab so we're just gonna be have to waiting here so right now I was waiting here so see you guys can see that it's coming up retrieving the engagement detail so it gives you two uh, two things right here one's the real lab and one is the basically uh, how to uh, all the documents so some of the like the the documents that are related to the actual lab so for this lab you don't really need to uh, uh, follow these uh, manuals right here so you can see right now it just opened up Windows server 2012 r2 data center which is the new server so it tells you how powerful this is this because you don't need to install all the server stuff on your machines if you are just doing help desk job and you're preparing yourself you you you're never gonna need this stuff because that's more of an administrator's job to do this so it's so easy for you guys to practice without any using any equipment or anything like that so now you have a server which I have it right here so when you click on it sometimes it don't work you see I, I can't do any clicking so what you do is you click on the start here and then click OK and just wait a second now you, you will be able to click on it you can see that I can open a server manager here so when you when you click on the server manager here it will take you to the active directory right here so now you can click on tools and there you go you have active directory users and computers so when you click on that 
this is the same exact thing that we basically covered in that course so you can work on the user side you can add computers you can reset accounts you can basically do anything in this lab you have 119 minutes to practice so this is the best way to me to learn these things with i mean before a year ago you we didn't have this technology and people were installing servers just to get to this point now microsoft has already provided so i really thank you uh, to, uh, that's a great thing for Microsoft you have other servers that you want to play around with but for this lab what you are worried about is your domain control which is your actual directory where you practice you can add computers or users and then you can come to the admin and use this as a client basically this is 8.1 pro so what can you do from this lab too you can basically learn about 8.1 professional and uh, go through this video uh, this uh, whole operating system find out things do some things over here in, um, in, in Active Directory and then apply it over here you add the user in this and then come back here and then sign in as him put a group policy on it do a lot of stuff play around with it um, and specifically for this lab try to stick with the Active Directory learn all of that stuff that we just we basically covered in this course which is right here so go through all of these videos then open this lab and start practicing so this is uh, the video about uh, having a lab without having any servers installation uh, and this will answer a lot of my learners who are asking me do we really need a server for this no you don't you can just directly go in there and start learning thank you for watching this video hopefully you guys learned something See you guys in a different video.